want to run a profile across this, across this part and probably run a profile across this okay so we are going to run a profile east to west in this direction all right so uh, this gym sees you will not find it here so i'll show you how you make it come on go to gs load menu search for g gym sees so you say open to open and that's when you will find this that's when you find this uh, this main level okay so you you click on it go to new model go to new model map profile um you put our name Taking our graph to grid, taking the deviation grid, and we we'll say finish. We we'll overwrite the one we're trying to do before, and say okay. Use your left button to choose the start of the profile, use your left button to choose the end of the profile, use your right button to click on done. And you say done, uh, it's going to show this. You say okay, you choose the coordinate system that it needs unknown so you just use unknown bring this down double This is our uh, is our elevation, and from our elevation, we can now know with this uh, knowledge of this is where you need to rack your head. You know, a lot of information that you derive from your studies and about the geology of the place. And then um, I've done some studies here. These are some. Yes, this is hundred with velocity thirty within the top thirty meter. This is your uh, geologic time scales. I'm not sure I'm not sure carried out this in the very salt to marine clay. Look at these sediments. If you help me to design the sediments properly, um, get the names of the formations their characteristics so you have to know their characteristics so that you can know coastal deposits located on the north coast of the land and the 